It is 5.39 a.m. We gotta get the cold plunge going. I've been doing that over the last couple weeks. I took the last couple days off. But now I'm gonna see if I can't work on doing 15 days in a row. See what happens. There's a lot of benefits to cold plunge. And we're gonna see if there's any noticeable difference. That water sure does feel cold. It says this water is about 55. Pro tip when you're filling this up, don't fill it up too high, put ice in there, and then get in there because of your body mass, all the ice goes out over the side. Give yourself a little room. A few reasons why I like the, the sauna box cold plunge. It's easy to move. It's small. You don't have to maintain a lot of water. You don't have to put a lot of ice in there to get it cool. Super simple to set up. Price was right. I actually got it with a, there's a sauna box over here, heat therapy or wet sauna. I got the sauna and the cold plunge. A pretty good deal. I think it was 150 bucks off or so. Yep, we got 50. It'll be good to go. We're gonna be in here two minutes. Just a reminder, you don't have to do this for very long. The study that followed a bunch of people to see what the optimal time and exposure duration was found that if you did sessions of one to two minutes in length for up to 11 minutes per week and around that 50 degree temperature that was the optimal amount of time for the amount of benefits that you would get and that if you did it colder or longer you didn't necessarily see greater gain of benefits. It's about two and a half to three minutes. Oh yeah, that is better than a cup of coffee. Well, I don't know if it's better than a cup of coffee, but it definitely gives you a huge spike of adrenaline, dopamine, uh, way more than a cup of coffee would. I highly recommend it. Of course, like a dummy, I forgot to bring a towel out. So let's go make some wet footprints in the house. My wife's gonna love that. Day one in the books. It is day two. We are gonna check temperature. I tried to took the cover off last night to let some of that heat out because I got a to 90 something yesterday. The temperature right now is 59. I did freeze some some ice blocks. We're gonna go get those, put those in. I gotta get it down to like 50. Hopefully it works, but even if it doesn't get down to 50, I'm gonna get in anyway. And then we'll have a full thing of ice tomorrow. We have a couple things of ice and this one. All right, let's let that sit in there for a minute. We're gonna check this temperature. Dropped it down for three degrees. So if you Google optimal temperature for cold plunge, it's between 50 and 60. So we're just gonna go with it. Set timer, two and a half minutes. Oh man, this sunrise is unbelievable. All right, it's not a cold plunge unless you get your face wet. Your head wet. Oh man. Just over two minutes. I'm gonna finish it up. I wanna stay out here and enjoy the sunrise. I think I'm done. Didn't want to do it this morning, but glad I did it. It's kind of with a lot of difficult things, right? If we're being philosophical this morning, I mean, it's the hardest things to do sometimes are the best things to do. Another thing that I like to do is come over here and sit at the edge of the patio and get some morning sun. It's not as difficult either as sitting in the cold water, but not a lot of UV rays hitting right now, but I kind of look out to the horizon and let my body know it's time to wake up and get out the day. Not a bad way to start the day. All right, day two in the books. See you tomorrow. Good morning. It is day three and it's time to put some ice in here. Just gonna throw these in here and melt just a few. So cold plunges, not the only thing that I'm doing to help myself out. I also wanna show you what supplements I'm taking. The first one is collagen and colostrum, MK supplements. Benefits gut health, immune support, healthy hair, skin and nails, bone, joint, and ligament support. Second one we have is DHEA, about 10 milligrams. I take about 20 milligrams a day, sometimes 30, but it's good for immunity, overall health, libido, and next one is true niagen. This is NAD+. Plus for mitochondrial function. Magnesium, there's a lot of benefits for that, for sleep, mood, etc. Tyrosine, about 500 milligrams a day. Again, this is kind of a mood focus booster as well. And also have beef organs from MK Supplements. Uh, this is really good bio bioavailable nutrients. What's unique about this one is it has liver, heart, spleen, kidney, pancreas, and it has it in the ratios of which you would get it from the animal itself. It says it's the ideal way to replace traditional multivitamins with a natural animal-based solution. I also take creatine, little creatine gummies, and each gummy has 1.5 grams of creatine monohydrate. Another thing you should check out is this Quip Prime Protein. 
The salted caramel, I also have the chocolate back here, but this is a super clean way to get pro protein. It doesn't have any gluten, dairy, whey, soy, hormones, antibiotics, fillers, artificial sweeteners, or preservatives. So this is super clean, beef isolate, and throw it in your coffee in the morning. It tastes like a salted caramel, a latte. Time to get back out here, check the temperature. Yeah, let's check the temp. 53, 54. It's a timer for two and a half minutes. It's still cool. We got ice blocks up in here too. Oh yeah. Morning sun. This is day three, but I have cold plunged probably about 12 or 14 times over the last couple weeks. When I first got it about three weeks ago, I basically was doing every other day. There was a couple times that I did it every day. So I racked up some cold plunges. We went up and saw some family in Washington. So I stopped for like four or five days and now I'm back at it. What am I looking to get out of it? Well, A, just to do something different, shock my body and see what it does for me. I mean, there's a lot of health benefits as far as reducing inflammation. It's really the point of doing something hard and starting the day off with a challenge that you complete and it sets up the rest of your day for success. And that's really the overall goal, setting myself up for success, doing the things to help my health because we ain't getting any younger. All right, time to get out. Time to get that morning sun, sunrise. It's a good one this morning. Well, and I kind of figured out why. I already kind of knew why. But let's see, there it is. Uh, there's a big fire over that way. So it's been turning the sun orange. So hopefully they put the fire out. Still get that morning sun. Telling your body it's time to be awake and get the day going.